Using natural resources unique to Hawaii, artists showcase our one-of-a-kind pieces at the 23rd Annual Hawaii Wood Show. KITV 4's Ashley Moser gives us a look on opening day. It took me about 10 weeks to make this one. Woodworker Keith Miley is glad the hard part is over. Now he's showing off his latest piece at the Honolulu Museum of Art School Gallery. He's one of 48 artists who submitted work for the annual show. His creation, this tenor ukulele. Well, as a native Hawaiian artisan, it's special to use our local woods. And I'm real pre uh, prejudiced because to me, it, it just means so much more. His wood of choice comes from the Milo tree, only found in Hawaii. Milo is very nice to work with because it's, it's fairly tight green, so it finishes up very nice and shiny if you want it to be that way. Unlike Koa, uh, Koa is tough to work with. His second piece is the Pohaku Neva, or ancient Hawaiian weapon. Most of his art has a cultural connection. Altogether, a hundred pieces are on display for the exhibit, each with their differences. The purpose of the show um, is really to impart a knowledge and appreciation for woods that grow here in Hawaii that um, maybe were planted for different reasons um, or happen to be invasive species. Best of show winner Mats Vogelvik used seven different species to create his table. It's uh, inspired from an uh, old concrete arch bridge on the road to Hana on Maui. Hence the arches. Yeah, hence the arches. Organizer Marian Yasuda says each year artists bring new techniques to the woodworking community, helping put Hawaii on the map. That cross pollination of ideas and designs and techniques is, um, is really wonderful. Ashley Moser, KITV4 News. The exhibit at the Honolulu Museum of Art School will continue through mid October. It's free and open Tuesdays through Sundays.